Welcome to this video tutorial on the topic of DS Core. In this video, we will guide you through the process of connecting with DS System Monitor and we will demonstrate how the data exchange works between CEREC or Connect Software 5.2.3 or higher and DS Core. In our case, DS System Monitor is already installed. In order to secure the data exchange throughout the day, Please make sure to connect with DS System Monitor after you have started up the Acquisition Center in the morning. To do so, we tap the Show Hidden Icons button in the taskbar and select the DS System Monitor symbol. By tapping Login, a new window opens and we first choose the region where our practice is located. Next, we enter our DS Core account username and password and tap on Login. Now we get the confirmation that we are logged in. By tapping the link Open DS Core in Browser, we could connect with DS Core at this point. In our case, we will continue in the CEREC software in order to demonstrate the automated data exchange. Here we start in the administration phase. Our patient case contains a crown restoration on a lower premolar. After we have entered all mandatory data, we change to the next phase, the acquisition phase. As we will concentrate on the workflow in this video tutorial, we will skip the scanning process of all three image catalogs and you will see the final scanned catalogs next. After the scanning is completed, we move on to the next phase. The model phase. Now several messages are displayed. First, we get informed that the software creates the models. Then the software sets the model axis automatically. As well, the preparation margin is drawn automatically. And finally, the data is exported to DS Core. Next, we continue in our DS Core account. Here, we are logged in already. The patient data, which was exported from the CEREC software previously, is not yet listed under the column My Patients. That means that we first have to assign the patient to our DS Core patient database. As well, the small blue point placed on the bell to the right indicates that actions are needed. In order to assign the imported data, we open the System menu and choose the option Unassigned Files. Here we are asked to select the files we want to assign to a patient. For demonstration purposes, we will open the transmitted data first. At this point, please pay attention to the message in the lower left corner that this is not a medical device software. It is not intended to diagnose, treat, cure, or prevent any disease or health condition. This data can be used for information, education, or sharing purposes. We close the preview and set a check mark in order to continue with the assignment process. Next, we tap Create New Patient and the information transmitted by the CEREC software is filled in the appropriate fields already. Finally, we choose the Assigned Dentist and open the drop-down menu. We select one and tap the Create Patient button. Then we can assign the data to the patient and return to our dashboard. Now our case is added to the list of patients. By tapping on the patient's name, we can access the scans again. In order to get back to our dashboard, we click on the field with the same name. Thank you very much for your attention. We would like to wish you every success when working with DS Core.